show that z is equal to 6, 7 pi by 11 is a solution to this equation. You should not attempt any to find any other solution to this polynomial. So they don't want us to solve this and prove that this is a solution. They want to show us to show, show that this is a solution to this. So basically what they're asking us to show do is to put this in this and prove it to be equal to zero. Okay. Now, let me explain what is Z1. So this is 1. So 1 is called the radial distance. So 1 cis 7 pi by 11. Now what does that mean? Seven, 1 cis 7 pi by 11 means if this is your real arm and this is the imaginary arm and this has a unit circle. So the unit circle with a radius of 1. So this is 1, 0 and this is minus 1, 0. This is minus 1, comma, 0. So <clears throat> 1 cis 7 pi by 11 means you go a radial distance of 1 from the origin. From the origin, you go a radial distance of 1. And then you go from 1 anti-clockwise 7 pi by 11. So this is say, roughly 7 pi by 11, which is less than pi. So this is pi. So I can say this is roughly 7 pi by 11. So this point is what they're talking about. This point can be referred as z is equal to 1 cis 7 pi by 11. Okay, now can we refer this in a different way? Well, you can. This point, you can, suppose if you talk about this angle, this is going clockwise. So this angle, so 7 pi by 11, plus what gives you pi, so it will be 4 pi by 11. So this angle, if you go clockwise, can be referred as minus 4 pi by 11. Minus 4 pi by 11. So the same point can also be referred as, so z, this, I'll write it here, which is equal to minus 1 cis, minus 1 cis, minus 4 pi by 11. You can also prove this yourself. Uh, by uh, by putting this on a calculator. I hope you know this means this is cos, this is 1 cos, you can see this is 1 cos 7 pi by 11 plus i sine, i sine pi by 11, 7 pi by 11. So this is, you can put this on a calculator and it should be in radians. And if you go minus will make this whole thing minus so this is minus cos if you press minus cos minus 4 pi by 11 uh, minus i sine uh, minus 4 pi by 11 would also give you the will give you the same answer they both are one and the same okay so let me do this and show this on a calculator so um, this is a graphic calculator you can check this so this is cos, this is my calculator is set in radians by default. So it is 7, oops, okay, this is cos bracket 7 shift pi by 11 plus i, you can press option complex number i sine 7 shift pi by 11. Okay, close the bracket, which is this number. Okay, so, and if you go minus, so I have to cancel this, so it is minus cos, uh, minus cos, minus 4 pi, minus 4 pi by 11, minus i sine minus 4 pi by 11 will give you the same answer. So this is in rectangular form, so, and this is in polar form. OK, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in this. I'm going to prove that equal to 0. So I can say this is uh, cis 7 pi by 11 raised to 19 plus 
axis, uh, 7 pi by 11. I should remove the bracket from here. The whole raised to 14 plus sys 7 pi by 11 whole raised to 8 plus sys 7 pi by 11 raised to 3. I want to prove this equal to 0. So now using the Dimbov's theorem, this is sys. Uh, you have to multiply the argument. So the, mod the modulus is 1. So you have to raise the modulus by 19. That will give you 19. Sorry, 1. And you have to multiply the argument by 19. So 19 times, 19 times 7 is 133 pi by 11 plus 6. Uh, this would be 14 times. 14 times 7 is 98 pi by 11 plus sys. Uh, this would be 7 times 8 is 56 pi by 11 plus sys. This is 21 pi by 11. Now I want to write this 21 pi by 11. Okay, so this is the same as sys how much? I want to write this as an even power. So this is 12 pi, 12 pi plus pi by 11. So 12 times 11 is 132 plus pi by 11, which is 133 pi. Plus this, plus this, how much? 8 pi, 8 pi plus 10 pi by 11. I hope you can understand this simple maths. This is 88 pi plus 10 pi, which is 98 pi. I want to write this as an even pi. So I'm going to write this as 6 pi. 6 pi minus 10 pi by 11. Now, so this is this is 66 pi. Let me cross multiplying. So this is 60, 66 pi by 11 minus 10 pi by 11 is 56 pi by 11. Plus this. I'm going to write this as 2 pi. The reason I'll explain later. So this is 2 pi minus pi by 11. Okay, now the reason is <clears throat> you're going 12 pi. That means you're coming back. 12 pi by, plus pi by 11 means you're going uh, 6 times. You're coming 12 pi means all these are even pi. That means you're coming back at 0. And then you're going pi by 11. Here you're going coming at 0 and going to 10 by 10 pi by 11. Okay, so yeah, this simplifies to sys pi by 11. This is nothing but sys pi by 11 plus sys. You're making how many circles? You, one, 2 pi is one full circle, so that means you're going 4 times and then going 10 pi by 11. So that is same as 10 pi by 11 plus sys. This is minus 10 pi by 11, minus 10 pi by 11. And finally, this is this minus pi by 11. Okay, now I want to write this as the whole thing as pi by 11. Okay, so this will become, this is, this is, this, this is the same as this pi by 11. This is this pi by 11. Now, what can we do here? Can we write this as this pi minus pi by 11? Okay, the reason I'll explain this. This, this is 11 pi by 11 minus pi by 11 is 10 pi by 11. Plus, uh, I'm, I can write this as this pi by 11 pi by 11 minus pi. Okay, and this is nothing but this. This is this minus pi by 11. Minus pi by 11. Okay, now is the next to the most difficult step, yeah? Okay, now what does this mean? You're going 
pi and okay so let me explain this what does this mean so let me draw okay so this is the organ dragon this is a unit circle of radius one unit circle means radius one yeah what does this mean you're going say let me show you this is say pi by 11 this is a small angle so this is pi by 11 this is also pi by 11 from this arm okay so what does this mean so this means you go pi you go pi so this is whole pi and take away pi by 11 that means you're talking about this point this point can be say this is pi by 11 this is pi by 11 and this is if this if you're going this way you're going this way so if you're going this way this will be minus pi by 11 <coughs> going anti-clockwise is positive and going clockwise is negative by convention so this angle you can say you go pi and then you go clockwise pi by 11. so this is this point this is this point okay now the same point how can we describe this in a different way that means from 1 1 comma 0 from 1 comma 0 you first go to you uh, move a radial distance of 1 and then you go pi and then you go come back pi by 11 so you reach here how can you reach the same point the same point the same point you can say well you go minus 1 you go minus a radial distance of minus 1 and then you go minus pi by 11 so the same thing can also be written the same thing can also be written as minus 1 cis minus pi by 11 this is a bit difficult concept to understand here we are saying you go a radial distance of 1 and then you go uh, you move at an angle of pi and then you come back pi by 11 or the same thing you can reach here from here you go a radial distance of minus 1 and then you go clockwise pi, pi by 11 which is minus pi by 11 so this will change to this okay so now what will this change to so let me use a different color this what we're saying is you go you go a distance of okay here the same thing is here you can say from one you go a radial this uh, you move for minus pi okay you go minus pi and you go minus pi that means from this point you're go, reaching here uh, clockwise this is going minus pi and then you're going backwards that means that point be somewhere here okay say so this is from this point can we say this is it's not drawn to scale this is let's describe this you're going anti-clockwise you're going anti-clockwise so you can say this is pi by 11 this is pi by 11 so to reach to this point you you can describe it like this you're going from one because your one year one is sitting here that means you start at this point you go a distance of minus pi and then you go a distance of minus pi by 11 that means this point is this so this point you can describe as this minus pi plus pi by 11 plus pi by 11 so <clears throat> going this point green point is from one you're going pi uh, anti sorry anti-clockwise that means you're going a distance of minus pi uh, a rate uh, you are going at an angle of minus pi and then you're going at an angle of pi by 11 okay so you reach this point or well you can say you go minus one you reach here and you go a distance of pi by 11 so this point so let me use a different color so this is same as saying this is minus this minus this pi by 11 minus this pi by 11 
Okay, so this whole thing, I hope my explanation is clear enough. So this becomes, let me change color, this is sys, sys pi by 11 will remain pi by 11. This will become minus, what did you say, minus 1, so I'm not writing 1, minus, this is minus sys, minus pi by 11. And this will become minus sys, pi by 11. And this is, this is plus, uh, plus, plus sys, minus pi by 11, minus sys minus pi by 11. Okay, so can you see this is minus pi by 11. So, I hope you can see this cancels what? This would cancel this out. Okay, so this, this and this gets cancelled. You can cancel this out and you can cancel this. This is minus this, minus pi by 11 and this is plus this minus pi by 11. So this and this gets cancelled. Okay. And so what are we left with? That is equal to 0. So you can say hence proved. Hence proved.